Your chair is loud, dude. Okay, well, yeah. Ugh. I mean, it was a free chair. Shouts yeah. out to the sleeper. He found oh, it on the side of... I can't about it. You should. He found it on the side of the road. Okay. Yep, now we got a res token again. My top spot again? Yes, you Shit are. Shit tits. <laughs> See, no. I, like, that's the other thing that doesn't make sense. I don't understand what decides who goes into the top spot. I think it might be the person at the bottom goes to the top. Yeah, I think it cycles that way. That's weird. That token fucking evaporated. <laughs> <laughs> Non-existent. God, no. <laughs> mm. So hopefully by the end of the week of you guys watching these episodes, we'll actually get to the next town. <laughs> like so many people who watch this show are just like oh my god why didn't you guys just go ahead and do the um superb 2009 lovely method of final fantasy you know that was trademarked by deathblade xx deathblade x that's an edgy name right there yeah. <laughs> I'm like, when you said that name, all I could, all I could picture I was Reaper. No. I... <laughs> <laughs> You're off my list. Yes. Yes, Lord. Jesus. Mm-hmm. So I don't think, as, re as much as people complain about Reaper being edgy, we're talking about Reaper from Overwatch, by the way. Yeah. As, many, as much as people talking about Reaper being edgy as shit, I don't think... He is as edgy as Shadow the Hedgehog. That's an edgy motherfucker. That is like yeah. you look up edgy in the Webster <laughs> Dictionary, the uh, Urban Dictionary, the Rural Dictionary. I don't care what dictionary you look it up in. You look up edgy and you instantly slide your finger to the right and bam, Maria, <laughs> Maria. <laughs> Where's that damn fourth chaos emerald? Oh, I gotta play that game. Mm-hmm. Why? <laughs> good luck on your Sonic series, because I there you... are a lot of games that you're going to love playing. Then there's a lot of games you're not gonna enjoy I playing. I don't know how to do Sonic 06! I don't! I don't! I don't! Okay, so seriously, which one are you dreading more? I'm guessing that one. I'm but dreading- that or I'm dreading- Werehog? No, Sonic Unleashed is not a bad game. Oh no, I've been watching Game Grumps play that. Shout that's out to Game just, Grumps. That's just fucking funny. But also they chose to play it on uh, <laughs> <laughs> Oh Yes, that's what the that's the that's the fighting theme song. And it comes with every single time you encounter an enemy as a werehog, just out of nowhere, it's just it's just loud as shit and you're like, oh my god. Well, they want you to know that you're in a fight. That shit's random, you know? I mean, I understand that. Um, no. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave that as that. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. But no, the, you're talking about what, what game I'm dreading the most when it comes to the Sonic playthrough? Number one is actually not Sonic 06. Number one is actually Sonic 1. Sonic 1 mm. is a hard game. At least Sonic 06, you know most of your issues are gonna be like game faulty, not your you just fault. Gotta get, really you just gotta thing. get through the fight with Silver and then you're, <laughs> you're good. Just get through the fight with Silver and you're good. Sonic 1 on the other hand. Sonic 1, like you, okay, 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 okay. So with Sonic 1, you do Green Hill Zone. Oh, nothing too hard. You know, pretty straightforward. Marble Zone. Okay, a little bit. Go up a little spaces and you get to that goddamn, um, uh, the Labyrinth Zone. 
Yeah. Oh my god, I hate that boss fight. I, I, I hate it's it. I hate probably it. Probably the dumbest boss fight, it. in my opinion. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so <laughs> much. Yup. Sitting here ranting the raven, talking about fucking Sonic, y'all. I'm playing Final Fantasy. <laughs> you know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. I know I stayed at the end. Um, fuck me. We're okay, we're gonna go we're going to the next. Okay, we're just we're gonna beeline it to the next fucking. And just hope that we make it all the way over. Oh, fuck. Okay, the regular okay. we good. We're good. Look, we can do this. We got. They're this. luring us into a false sense of security, but we're good right now. I do love crazy. the fact that like the original Final Fantasy's characters were so like iconic that they still are shown in like later versions of the characters. Like the Black Mage is still. You know, dark robes, yellow pointy hat, and yellow eyes. Like, still, you'll see that in, like, the latest games as some kind of reference and stuff. I just think that's really cool. My favorite version of the Black Mage is the outfit that you get in, Fort in Final Fantasy fourteen. The first one you get when, oh, you, yeah. when you, like, max out your Black Mage mm -hmm. way back in the day. Yep. Like, because it... Your the eye, original end game. Yeah, because the headpiece covered one of your eyes mm -hmm. and you could only see one of your eyes. I, I, uh, I just, I, that's aesth cool. Aesthetically, I thought that was fucking awesome. Yup. Jesus Christ. I think you're going the right way. Oh, Jesus Christ. I hope you're going the right way. Oh shit, you're going the wrong way. That's an ogre. Oh my god, Matt. Where the fuck am I supposed to be going? Am I actually supposed to go through the bars? Maybe. Holy shit. I... And they, those creeps were fucking us earlier. They were. And now it's two creeps and Can't an ogre. Okay, 31 okay, damage. Okay, 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 still. Okay, run. Three damage. Yeah, I lived. Chainmail. Yep. 23 damage. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Get the fuck out of here. Alright, we're going. I think hey, that's Hey, yeah, that's Matoya's cave. So okay. Okay. Oh, Technically, oh, okay, okay, okay. This isn't can I use a tin? No, I just need the magic. Yeah, Hold if on. you just use some healing magic, you should be good. Uh, Plus, we still have the heal potions. Sure magic. That's fine. Yeah, it's better to save sleeps for uh, in battle. I feel like because you have a better chance of healing more. I think. Okay. Okay, this is Matoya's cave, so we technically went in the right direction. Push B, select. You have to do it after you finish talking. Like at the same time. Push B, B select. Select. It's a magic spell. Chris? Like hold down B. And then hit select at the same time. This is how you set the party order! I thought this was supposed to be the map effect. You should be able to- yeah, you should be able to like choose, like, say, me. And then go up. And then go up. And then- yep. And then switch token out from... Like, I could have sworn this was how you used to use the map, or else I would have told you this super earlier on. Because I remember B select, I just didn't remember. To... That's what it did, apparently. Remember, I also played the PSP version, which made it different. Treasure chests! Wait, why are we able to walk on the skulls? It's kind of messed up. Pure! Heal! I like how the treasure boxes don't even open. Alright. Gotta find her eye. Yep. And where is her eye? Where is my crystal? I can't see anything without it. Who stole my crystal? Uh, talk to all the brooms just in case. I should be select. I should be select. I don't think it's in this area. I think. You want me to look it up? You get to decide. 
Nah. Uh, we're gonna make a mad dash. At least now we know how to set up the party properly, so, you know, the mages aren't at the top. Like, the mages that shouldn't be at the top. <laughs> tap, 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 Matt, tap. I really feel like that lack of information has caused us much grief in these last five episodes of this It has. Like, all those times that it was you or sleep at the uh, top of the party? That was bad. That was really bad. God damn it, Matt. (laughs) (laughs) I didn't know! Jesus. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Alright, focus. We have to save the world. We have... First, we have to be able to live through fucking basic fights. We can do... See? We're gonna fuck okay, these wolves, wolves up. Wolves, okay. We're gonna fuck these wolves up. Alright, me and my posse, we're just gonna come in. We're gonna fuck them. See? 60 damage. Shit, I didn't do good enough. Yeah, 26. There we go. That's one dead. Alright. We so got this. How much health do these motherfuckers have? 20? 25? Probably about 25, I'd say, yeah. Oh my god, I fucking missed. Shit tits! He missed me! Aha! Uh-huh. He missed me! Damn, dodging like a champ for being a black mage. What's you trying to say? Bruh, in most games, how well can a black mage dodge? Nothing. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I fucking hate you, Matt. <laughs> there was a joke in there, and you just completely, you just completely went over your head. No, I didn't want you to point out how racist I was sounding. <laughs> Oh no! No 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 no! The good people of the world knew how racist you were sounding. You right. I'm gonna go back to drinking my orange drink. I hate you so much. The one that's right beside the sprite. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Don't choke on your aspirations, white man. <laughs> aspirations. Shut the fuck up talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. Yeah, I win. God damn it! Is damn it! it. Why should you make everybody text? I didn't think it was gonna die. <laughs> Fucking dying and shit. How dare it actually die to your attacks? Matt, you will shut the fuck up <laughs> while I play this game. <laughs> <sighs> Funny. No, <laughs> no, you. <laughs> this is a high stress environment. Oh I'm, my god, why is everybody missing? Jesus Christ, like, no one knows Thank how to- Thank you! Oh, Jesus Christ, well, I mean, it is a wolf. But, but still, like, literally, you are the only person that entire turn, including the wolves, I think, to hit anything. <laughs> the evade stat in this game- The evade stat in this game is bollocks. <laughs> god damn it! Wait, wait, no, no, no. Okay, there we go. Okay, oh, no, it's not dead yet. No, I thought that one was gonna... Okay, you finished... Yeah, so I think they do have, like, 25 health. So that seems about right. Man. Shit tits. In effect... God damn it. <laughs> Kill it. Nope, still alive. Damn it! <laughs> we need the next upgrade of weapons, but we don't know where the town is. <laughs> Mm-mm. Good old fashioned Final Fantasy 1 and get yeah. fucking laws. Okay. Guys, I hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. Because I sure am. <laughs> yeah, he sure is. <laughs> fucking oh, oh, yeah, I don't trust the desert. Well, YOLO! <laughs> Go south, I think. Okay. Oh, never. Yeah, it's one creep. Oh, it's one creep. How deadly can one little creep be? I'm just saying we have a better chance against a one rather than I'm two going to and light an ogre. It on fire. Okay, eleven damage. Great. Okay, good, good. God, this is not great. Damn it, token. Hey, Whoa! he missed you. Nice. Yeah, he missed me. Creeper can't creep on these. Nineteen. Okay, we're doing some damage. It lit. 34 damage, and it's terminated. terminated. Yes! I really thought I was still alive, I'm not gonna lie to you. I was not gonna lie, but I'm <laughs> sad. I'm to go no through or no rather that shit. <laughs> was not about to be happy. Is 
think it's over here. I might be wrong. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So long. Yeah, I was going to say, get rid of the Great Wolf first. Like we have learned in very painful experiences. You know what? I'm going to try something. Go for it. Oh, you're thinking about trying harm? Honestly, I tried on just. Ah, like, I didn't mean to attack. I I, to imagine. If you want to try it out, I tried it out on like a weak enemy group. Like, a, say, like when we run into like a bunch of imps again. Alright, 24 damage. Alright, got Alright. Good, good, good. You know what's kind of funny? What up? So, in this and in Dragon Quest, like. Their main thing to show you that like an enemy was stronger, but was by changing the color palette. Mm -hmm. So, which makes sense, you know. Again, like they were, you know, they had limitations and everything. I'm strong, but I'm stronger just because I put on a red shirt. Exactly. <laughs> and so, my thing that I think is funny about this is the fact that even now, like on PS4, they still do that. Yeah. I know. Like they still stick to that. Like, it's, a, it's fancier, and there might be a few extra additions, but it's pretty much, hey, look at me, I'm that same blue monster from before, but now I'm red, and, like, say I have, like, a it flaming saved, weapon instead well, of a regular the weapon. The main reason why they did that was to save on acids. It was easier for mm. the acid list to stay low, just doing a palette swap. Because right. you have to keep in mind, these games literally were less than one song, one MP3 song on your, on your phone. Very true. Actually, no, to be fair, three NES... Three to four NES games equal one song on your fucking... on your phone. That's how little bit of space you were dealing with. Right. When you now, consider that, that, it's really impressive what they were able to pull off. And that's why the big... the race to UCDs was such a big thing. Yeah. But... Of course, with great power comes great responsibility because with CDs, uh, shit was so easy to fucking get pirated, and that's why mm. Nintendo, for the longest time, did not want to use CDs. And even when they did use CDs, they used those awkward ass <clears throat> mini CDs that only held a gig and a half, and it was, oh, it was a bad. It was a bad time for everyone. So true. And that's why Symphonia was too flipping mini disc. <laughs> And I'm just like, why Nintendo? I mean, I understand because it's a lot of money. When, right. When yeah, I mean, it does make shit, sense. I learned that through school. Like, when people pirate your shit, you lose a lot of money. Mm -hmm. and, you know, and me being, you know, snot those brat that I was, I was pirating the shit many, many years ago. Not now. So yeah. you can't give me more, but many, many years ago, man, I, I, I used to do that shit. And I was like, oh. I mean, so bad, I feel like most people go through that phase, especially like with the with the um, like age that we grew up. Where well, everybody had fucking LimeWire and FrostWire. Yeah. Oh my god. We everybody. It gave your shit. computer cancer just to listen to the mo the, the the most recent mixtape. Oh man, mm -hmm. I remember when it destroyed my my computer. I was so sad because I couldn't watch porn for like a week. Back then, That's a sad. Phones were crap, so you couldn't watch yep. porn on your phone. You couldn't watch porn on your computer. Oh no, talking about porn on the computer, dial up, trying to look at porn. Don't even. Mm -mm, uh, mm -mm, Matt. The greatest of struggles. Matt, I, my mom, <laughs> for a while, my mom was trying to go through that whole save money by cutting out the non necessities. So uh, she cut off our internet, and I couldn't. And the thing is, okay, she cut off our internet. And I was like, I thought I was slick, you know, because I'm smart. Mm -hmm. So. The neighbors above us had internet. They had Wi-Fi, but that bitch was not locked, and it wasn't locked for the longest. So I was watching Buku's amounts of porn on their shit. Mm -hmm. And I mean, you talking about Buku's amounts of porn? I'm surprised the motherfuckers didn't put out a freaking APP trying to figure out who the fuck was watching so much porn. Because I was watching a lot, a lot of porn on their damn internet. And then one day, I go to my laptop, I was getting ready to just Make the damn deposit. <laughs> the motherfucker was locked. I was so you talk about somebody sad. Like hey, that sad music starts playing in the background. You're just like, huh? why? 
well, like everything else around you just like comes to a stop. A, a, a screeching halt. Mm-hmm. Like all the color in your life just instantly like, turns to gray. <laughs> yep. and you're just like all joy, what all can, happiness is what gone. Can I, do to fix? I almost for a second I almost went up to to the to the upstairs and was like, I will pay you guys <laughs> to let me masturbate. <laughs> While using your internet. Oh my god. I need it to live. <laughs> oh shit. So That's so bad. After they lock after they locked their internet. Oh my god, am I going the right way? Fuck about right. We're gonna find out eventually. Hey, there's a there's, town. There's a town down there. Oh my god. Monsters attack first. This is gonna fucking Jesus oh Christ. Oh god, this is gonna be bad. Well I'm gonna sit here and watch the fireworks happen. But anyway, back two to minutes the, later, back to the story. She, my mom, the, the internet around us was locked. My mom got rid of the internet. This was in two thousand four, five. I want to say five. No, this was in two thousand five or the summer of two thousand six. One of those. Anyway, mm-hmm. it was the summertime. I didn't have a job just yet, and I was like, I got to do something. I've Ooh, got Tolkien needs some healing. Just gonna point that out right quick. Oh shit, you right. Um Continue. so <laughs> So, um, I did what any sensible person would do at this point. Mm-hmm. I got a bunch of AOL trial discs. Yes. I tried to, I signed up for that shit. It took forever. And I mean forever to go through those damn menus. Guess what, motherfucker? You had yourself some internet. Oh <laughs> yeah, fifty-two kilobit per second. Goodness, oh man, oh man. It. Okay, great. Okay, great. Cool, cool, cool. It was slow. Mm-hmm. There was some days when I just be like, "Is this worth it? Can I go on like this?" <laughs> So, you laugh. No, I, I also know the feeling, dude. Like That laptop I use, oh my god, it was a hand-me-down laptop, and that shit was cardboard. So I'm like... But I put you... Windows... It was it was a Windows 98 laptop, but I put mm. Windows XP on that bitch just to see if it, if it could run it. It yeah. ran it, and it, 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 it worked. It was not fast. You had, to load them, you had to load them videos up and sit there for a minute, sitting there thinking to yourself while you had your meat in your hand, like... <laughs> Hmm, what shall I do today? <laughs> like, I'm having to ponder life while you're waiting. While you wait on the motherfuckers to load it, because if not, you had to deal with buffering. And no one, no one, no one, no one wants to deal with all that buffering. No one. That's a song that truly really touches me in a lot of ways. <laughs> I'm sure you are. Shut the fuck up, <laughs> But no, uh, like, so when I was growing up. Jesus Christ! Holy shit. Stop well, taking all that good. goddamn damage! But yeah, when I was growing up, as you know, I have an older brother. And so, you know, we had a curfew and all that good stuff. But the thing was that we had one computer. Our first computer was a gateway computer. Ooh, that damn gateway and was Garbo! We had only one phone line, so our mm. parents gave us a specific time at night, where it was like a two-hour period. We were each allowed one hour of that two-hour period to be on the computer. Hmm. <laughs> Guess how many times I stayed at home sick from school? <laughs> God damn that. You're a fucking savage. <laughs> Oh my god. Like, I never did that. <laughs> oh man, I remember the first time I, oh man. How much time have we got? Mm, like five, five minutes. Booyah. I'm okay, good. maybe I can cram this story in. But the first time <laughs> I ever like, shut it. up. <laughs> the first, I remember the first time I actually got fucking caught with porn. That was an experience I never want to repeat. Mm. Um, because kind of like your, kind of like with you, this happened early in my years. I'm mm. talking about 2002. Yeah. So I was like 12, and I was one of those kids. I, I admit it. I admit it. I was one of those not no kids that 
thought that I could do whatever and I get and get away with it. Right. So one morning while I'm waiting on the bus, um, I go on the family computer and I been knew how to navigate porn sites. I just never did it because it was a family computer. Mm-hmm. Well, I figured out the secret of, you know, destroying your history. And I was like, well, that's I had a good trick to learn. I had age. the keys to success. Nothing was going to stop me. So, just so you know, I'm out of magic. I know you're out of magic. I think so sleeper. Nope, not. two spells left. Okay, that'd be right to take care. Um, fuck. Fuck. So, I I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Before the bus comes, I'm going to go to mm-hmm. the bus school and have a fucking wonders day. So, Get that good old stress relief. I will never forget this moment for the rest of my life. Because to this day, I'm actually getting kind of goosebumps right now. But, just remembering what happened. But I remember, I was getting to get in Found me some good shit to look at. And all of a sudden, and mind you, my mom worked early in the morning, so she left to go to work at um, like five in the morning. Mm-hmm. And the bus came at seven nineteen or some shit like that. Because my school was right down; it was a straight shot right down the road. Right. So, um, my mom had been at work, and I'm thinking everything's cool. Just getting it. Just getting it, getting it. Next thing I know, I hear that screen door open to my house. Mind you, I was at the house. I thought I was at the house. Mm-hmm. I mean, I was at the house by myself, waiting on the bus. And I heard that screen door open, and my heart just dropped. Mm. My heart just, I just, it's because I knew what, I knew the order of events. And yep. I was like, I can't do this fast enough. Mm-hmm. She's already here. So, she came in, and she's like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I just give her this look, and I'm just like, nothing, 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 nothing. My mom's all like, okay. So, I try to, (laughs) I try to go to my room, get my shit, and bounce. Mm -hmm. (laughs) So, at least I can go to school without the word about it until I get home. Right, at least postpone it. Oh no, I'm in my room. I'm getting my shit together, and I guess at that time my mom saw where the websites I was looking at, and she instantly like, I'm in my room, and she's just, she, I, 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 I'm putting on my shoes, and I look up, and she's just standing there looking at oh, me. Oh god! With that, that, that death commanding mm-hmm. stare, and I just knew. I was like, I'm dead. I'm, I'm flipping dead. I'm yep. dead. I am dead. D e d dead. Dead, super dead. I am dead beyond belief. I'm more dead than that wolf. Dead. <laughs> like, and she proceeded to give me one of the worst whoopers I've ever had. Right before I got on the bus, and she told me straight up. She said, "You gonna get a whooping now, and you gonna get a whooping when you get home." So it's one of those things like you got your ass beat before you went to school. <laughs> and you have to think about it all and you day. You gotta think about it all day. And you think, and, and on your heart, you're just like, well, maybe, maybe she'll forget. Maybe she'll look down, she won't remember. Oh, oh no. that, that's that optimism, I right? I got off the bus. <laughs> my mom was literally sitting in the door waiting on me. And mm. my mom always liked to be on the phone. And she used to brag about beating my ass. Like, she'd be on the phone talking to, like, her friend or whatever. And she'd be like, girl. But anyway, he just came through the door. Now I gotta beat his little ass. And I'm just like, that seems a little fucked up. I'm not gonna lie. It's a little fucked up, but she would be like, she, and then she would just get all like, she's like, oh, I gotta beat your ass. And then like, she just, and she, it's like, a real like, chore. Like, like she just beat my ass. And then oh my god, and then my stepdad had to get involved, Ugh. and he was all like, "What do you learn? You can't go to those websites." I'm like, "What do you think I learned? I learned you learned how to get caught." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I've been going to these. I basically was just like, I've been on these websites. I just didn't tell you. And he was just like, How? How did you do it? How did you? How did you do this? God damn it! 
Okay, it's yes, one iguana. It's one iguana. I swear for God. How much time we got? Wait, it literally just rang. <sighs> Do the comic question of the day. I gotta fight this one. All right, guys. Um, <laughs> I guess we're gonna go with what we were talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Do you recall a time when you got your ass beat? <laughs> yep. For <laughs> looking at that boy. Oh, let man. us know in the comments. Let section. us know in the comments. You know what? No, genuinely, let us know yeah. some times that you got caught doing something you weren't supposed to be doing, and you, and you got a, 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 a whooping or something like that. <laughs> and if you're one of those goody goody two shoes, fuck you, kids. It's like I never got in trouble. No one cares, right? No one cares. So for the next episode, I'll tell you about what happened when I got caught. So until next time, see ya. Stay sexy. Hit it. And I'm hitting it again. Hit it one more time. Hitting it.